Hi, I'm Josh Berman from Clifford Chance's Washington, D.C. office. As we begin to dip our toes into the post-pandemic world, one thing is clear. There will be a spike in investigations and inquiries from prosecutors, law enforcement agents, and regulators around the globe and in the United States. How do we know this? On behalf of clients, we've been dealing regularly with the Justice Department, the Treasury Department, the Commerce Department, the SEC, State Attorneys Generals, DFS, and others. And what they tell us in our meetings is while there have been some cases during the pandemic, we should expect a a spike in cases after the pandemic. Why is this? Their investigations have been continuing. They've been looking at documents. They've been looking at records. They've been preparing witness interviews. And what we will see as the pandemic lessens and the world opens up a bit, a spike in witness interview requests, grand jury requests, document requests, and investigations. Specifically, we're going to see this in several areas. We will continue to see it under the Foreign Corrupt Practices Act. Pre-pandemic 2020 was already going like that. We're going to see it continue to spike. Prosecutors at the Justice Department's Fraud Unit, which is responsible for the FCPA, as well as the SEC, FCPA Unit, and the FBI, have been sitting on a series of cases. So clients who have compliance functions, accounting functions, treasury functions, and general counsel offices should be prepared for those investigations to come. Likewise, the SEC has been investigating trades not only related to COVID, but also not related to COVID. And those trading and insider trading cases will see an increase in the post-COVID world. We're going to see a series of enforcement actions. We're going to see subpoenas and document requests from the SEC. And again, those are trading activities which will come under inquiry and under focus. Third, congressional investigations absolutely will increase both because November 2020 is a significant election year and there are investigations that have been underway already and when they come to light, there'll be enhanced activity. That shouldn't surprise anyone and certainly should not surprise clients. Finally, we're going to see an increase in COVID-related mail and wire fraud investigations. Look, there's no way that investigators and regulators are going to let frauds that took place because of COVID sit unattended to. Instead, we're going to see those make the front pages of the news. Expect a lot of activity from your local law enforcement and global law enforcement agents as soon as the world opens up.